Hey, big guy. I, uh, I assume the whole place is surrounded? Just you and me. Who are you? I'm here on behalf of S.H.I.E.L.D. We need you to come in. What if I say no? This has the potential energy to wipe out the planet. What does Fury want me to do? Swallow it? It emits a gamma signature that's too weak for us to trace. There's no one that knows gamma radiation like you do. Just you and me. I got me one! I got me one! Good to go on this end. The rest is up to you. Stark Tower is about to become a beacon of self-sustaining clean energy. Sir, Agent Coulson of S.H.I.E.L.D. is on the line. I'm not in. I'm actually out. Sir, I'm afraid he's insisting. Gross fine, Jarvis. Levels are holding steady, I think. Of course they are. I was directly involved. Which brings me to my next question. How does it feel to be a genius? Well, <laughs> I wouldn't know that now, would I? Maybe you should ask that arc reactor of yours. Sir, the telephone. I'm afraid my protocols are being overridden. Shouldn't you answer that? It could be serious. Phil sounds pretty shaken. Phil? His first name is Agent. You have reached the life model decoy of Tony Stark. Please leave a message. This is urgent. Then leave it urgently. Security breach. Mr. Stark. Phil, come on in. We're celebrating. Why is he Phil? Is this about the Avengers? Which I, I know nothing about. The Avengers initiative is scrapped. I thought, and I didn't even qualify. I didn't know that either. Yeah, apparently I'm volatile, self-obsessed, don't play well with others. That I did know. This isn't about personality profiles anymore. Granted. I need you to look this over as soon as possible. Official consulting hours are between 8 and 5 every other Thursday. This isn't a consultation. What is all of this? This is uh, this. Jet to DC tonight. You have homework. You have a lot of homework. Poor Captain Steve Rogers. A man at a time. I mean, literally. Back when he first became Captain America, he had so many adventures and faced such incredible foes. I wonder if the future will be any different for him. Anyway, Cap had many strange adversaries, but none were as dangerous as the Red Skull and Arnim Zola. It's a good thing that he had help from Peggy Carter and his best friend Bucky Barnes. Trouble, 
slipping. <sighs> Excelsior. Front. This looks like yet another perilous predicament. Zola, what do you think? A masterpiece. What is happening? Captain America. How exciting. Oh, come on. Let's go. Ah. Captain America. This is just like one of your films. You and your pathetic sidekick are just in time to witness. The true strength of Hydra! Captain Rogers, come in. Steve, are you there? Wait, is that radio of yours broken again? I hope you're receiving this message. The Red Skull can be extremely dangerous. Proceed with caution. to see how the shielded stooge fares against them. Of course, Herr Schmidt. Activating cannon defenses. Thank you. 
designs need a little more work, Sola. I am sorry, Ashmeet. The next one will be better. Just afraid to admit that we have left humanity behind. Unlike you, I embrace it proudly, without fear. to stay and have a pleasant chat, Captain. But I have plans that cannot be put on hold, even for you. We need to catch him. There must be another way around. Yeah. Oh. 